Jim, how was your first game in charge? Um, listen, I think obviously we're always uh, disappointed uh, when we don't win games of football, especially having been in front for so long in the game and, and the manner of the, uh, the equaliser is extremely disappointing. But, you know, I think considering the circumstances, uh, the lack of preparation, um, you know, the boys weren't able to train yesterday due to the weather up in Aberdeen. Um, you know, I have to commend the players for, for what they've given me in terms of their attitude and their application. And that's all it could be today, Rob. You know, there was no time before the game to, to make drastic changes. You know, I had literally 15 minutes with the boys last night you know, 15 minutes back in the hotel this morning. And uh, we just tried to keep things as simple as possible today. Do the basics well, defend well. You always know you're going to be in a battle here anyway. Um, you know, they rely heavily on set plays and getting the big bodies in your box. And the boys had to stand up to that. And I thought they did. Um, there's no doubt that we will improve going forward. You know, we need to to play better football and be a bit more attractive and easy on the eye but we knew today wasn't going to be like that you know there was a pitch inspection here at 10 o'clock the grass looks as if it hasn't been cut for a week and I think the ground staff here done well to get the game on because there was a lot of water here early on this morning but look we want to win every game we go into no doubt about it but um, today I think a, a point is probably a fair result given you know what's went on and um, it's another point on the board and another step in the right direction. What struck me, I think, having been here last weekend, was it, there was there was more toughness about Aberdeen. It, there were it was more competitive. Listen, I I think that's well that, that was a big part of my my conversation with them um, today before the game. You know, I want to see who wants to be here. It's as simple as that. You know, I'm judging everybody at the moment, um, staff and players alike. You know, I want people at the club who are committed, who are willing to give their all, and um, you know, it's. Uh, it's a tough task we have on our hands, but I think there's enough here within the group to start climbing the table. But first and foremost, we have to be more organised, we have to be more solid, we have to get back to keeping clean sheets, which I think is the easy part of coaching and of managing. I think that can be easily ironed out in the next week or so. And then obviously we need to tidy up at the top end of the pitch, we need to carry more of an attacking threat. Um, you know, We need to give those boys up there a bit of confidence. We can't rely solely on Christian Ramirez. Uh, was delighted for wee Vinny today getting his goal. I thought it was a well worked goal actually. It was a good ball in behind from Bates and a, a really good ball across. But look, there's certainly room for improvement. There's no doubt about that. Um, you know, I wouldn't be in this position if uh, you know if things didn't need to improve. Mm. And um, they will improve as we go forward because we're going to work extremely hard in the weeks and months ahead to make sure that we climb the table and get back at the right end where this club belongs.